This is a Nine News update. Good evening, Tim McMillan with you. A 20-year-old man who was the victim of a cowardly attack by five strangers has told Nine News of his terrifying ordeal. Michael Gunton was set alight as he was on his way to the shops. He ran to the Cannington Police Station and was rushed to hospital with extensive burns to his body. They just kind of came up from behind me and all I felt was um, like a cold liquid. Uh, just run down my shirt. A fire came scarily close to the Quinana shopping centre and dozens of homes today. We pretty much just left home and closed everything down. I got my dogs ready and all the things that I need to take. At one point, flames jumped Gilmore Road and burned next to an aged care facility. Four holidaymakers have been burnt in an explosion at a campsite in Collie. The blast was caused by a portable gas cylinder that overheated. My chest is burnt, um, my face a bit, and the back of my shoulder and my arm. An Albany court has released security vision that helped convict AFL player Marley Williams of assault. The Collingwood defender was found guilty over the attack that left a man with a broken jaw. And a man has been arrested after allegedly swallowing a $200,000 pink diamond at a Cairns jewellery store. Preliminary x-rays failed to detect the precious gem, but the 29-year-old man remains under police guard. Sunny tomorrow, 34, up to 35 on Sunday, 34 again on Monday. That's all from the Nine Newsroom for this Friday. Have a great weekend. Good night.